Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh! Gotta go! Gotta go! He's he's uh, it's gonna run out. You gotta. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a closer look at this new robot called Favness. So uh, this is what the robot looks like. Um, it has four medium weapon slots. Uh, this is what it looks like in 3D view. Okay, and um, it has three passive, one active, as you can see here. And this is what it says in the description. So. Uh, the ability is called Shapeshift, which is the same ability as the Loki, Tyr, and Fenrir. Um, it says here, um, is free to switch between walking and flying, staying in any mode for as long as you need. So, I guess it's kind of like an Aoming. Okay, and it says here, while on the ground, it gets increased defense and four weapon slots. Um, so, when you're on the ground, you're actually pretty strong. Um, I would say probably the strongest uh, when you are on the ground, uh, because you have resistance and you can fire all four weapons. Um, it says here, in the air, the robot disables two of its weapon slots, instead enabling a built-in weapon that deals increased damage to titans. So that part kind of reminds me of the Hawk, okay? So when you go into flight, uh, you won't have the resistance. Um, you do, however, have a built-in weapon that's going to do a lot of damage to titans, and you can also fire two of your weapons. And then it also has here, activates an absorber shield for several seconds when it starts to take off. So this is really like a cross between a Tear, um, an Ares, and a Hawk. So very interesting combination. Um, cooldown time, 20 seconds, built-in weapon range, 350 meters. That's pretty close. I wonder how this is going to work out. Defense points, 200 uh, points here, and um, damage dealt to Titans, 200%. Okay, so I have three of these in my hang. I couldn't, uh, you know, put all five because the game wouldn't allow me, or at least... I should say the test server didn't allow me to do that. Um, but we do have uh, three of these. Uh, we have the Scaddy. I think that's how you pronounce his weapons. Um, we have the Scourge and also Havoc. Now, I'm going to be playing two games. So I'm going to switch up the weapons uh, for the second game. And I also have the Ravana here and the uh, Behemoth with the Hell. Okay, so yeah, it's going to be really interesting. So I'm going to jump into a game here. and Let's see how we actually do uh, with this new robot, Favna. Okay, so we've just dropped into Power Plant map, and um, I have started with the Favna first. So this is what it looks like when you go into uh, flight. And you know what, I think the animation is kind of messed up, because I'm pretty sure I saw like the wings kind of animate out when I last uh, tested this. Oh jeez, I can actually hit- wait, I can hit that Loki? That was interesting. <laughs> I'm trying to- oh wait! Did we get him? So the trick with this bot, you don't want to go into flight because if you do, um, unless he's a titan, but if you go into flight, you actually get killed really fast. So you have to be careful of that. What is this Suplurin? So he's locked me down. I'm trying to break that shield of his it's actually taking me a lot longer than I thought it was going to take there we go um, I'm trying to hit this uh, Loki oh yes I got him <laughs> that's funny without using quantum radar too jeez these guys have a lot of physical shields but that that's actually pretty smart because you know what they're using a counter to this and they have they have actually another shell here so I have to be careful of that guy Let's focus on this uh, player here. Triple kill. Trying to let my uh, weapons charge up a little bit more here before I engage. Okay, let's engage this guy. Burn that shield off. Focus on that player. And this guy here. Trying to really melt him up. Rampage. So you notice what I'm doing, I'm not going into flight, because if I go into flight, I am going to uh, go down really quickly. I have no resistance that way. Let's try to take out uh, this uh, Ao Jung here, I'm trying to heal up. Uh-oh, 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 ooh! And this guy! Whoa! Beyond godlike! I need to actually heal up. Oh, yes, living legend. 
Man, this thing is crazy strong. Actually, it's more the weapons that are crazy strong. I target this guy. Maybe I can get this guy. Take him out. I got suppressed. Man, this is just one bot. I haven't even dropped into the other bots yet. I get around the corner here. Try to target this guy. Trying to take him out before he gets to that side there. And... Oh! This guy's going to land here soon. There we go. Jeez. Okay, let's go on a flight to uh, steal this one if we can. Oh, here we go. Let's see how much damage we do to this, uh, this Minos. So you can see the built-in weapon firing. Can you see that? A couple of projectiles. We're actually doing decent damage to him. But he is getting hit by a hawk as well. Okay, let's drop in with the uh, next one. Let's use the Havoc. I think this game's going to be over pretty soon here. Maybe I can target that player. Now let, let's try to see if we can target, uh, target this guy. So 350 meters is... We need to get within range. I'm just going to let that... The uh, built-in weapon fire at him. I'm looking to see how much damage it actually does. Definitely not like a hawk. Because I'm not firing any shots. I'm just letting, you know, the built-in weapon do its uh, thing here. Trying to get within 350, but I think the game's going to end. Wow, that's pretty crazy. So, the second game, I'm going to switch out the, uh, you know, the scatty weapons. Uh, maybe put something like Cryo in there. But man, that was just one bot mostly. 1.4 million, 8 kills, 1 beacon. Okay, so game two, we have dropped in on Power Plant map. And um, I have started with the uh, Favna first. I'm uh, actually going to uh, drop to the ground here quickly because um, I don't have resistance when I'm in the air like that. We need to try to target... Uh, we need to get into this gap area. Just trying to hit that one player. Try to move into uh, this gap area here. If we can get this beacon, that would be nice. Hold up. This guy is taking on quite a bit of damage. He, uh, he went into stealth. It's this guy and got him. Yes. Can I get him in the air? Where is he? Oh, wait, we can't. No, we killed him. Whoa! Oh, jeez, look at my health. You see how quickly my health dropped? I didn't have that resistance. I need to heal quick. Heal! Oh! I'm trying to get... Oh, I'm trying to get this... Uh, we can... Let's take this guy out. I was trying to get this beacon. This guy went into flight. Um, I might be able to kill him here, actually. There we go. Ooh, a lot of players here. <laughs> We're trying to get that beacon there. You know what? Let's drop in with the Scourge build. What is this player in? Let's do that. You know what? The Scourge build is actually pretty decent. Yep, he's struggling against me. Uh, we can probably actually take or get this guy down to his last stand. So you see how quickly his health uh, dropped? Because he's in the, uh, the air like that. He needs to drop down quick. I think he realized it afterwards. Yep. Okay, so 
We need to get some beacons here because we are down on beacons. Looks like we're dealing with a, uh, a Hades. Let's get this guy down to his last stand. Last stand has been triggered. Let's try to do that because I have an absorber shield. And maybe target this guy, although I'm not sure how much damage we are going to do to him. Nope. <laughs> I guess that answers that question. Let's drop in with the uh, ignitable next. Let's roast up this guy. Holy crap, that's a lot of damage output that... My gosh. Uh oh, uh oh. Come on, we gotta take out this guy. You know what I can do is I can go into flight. This way I have an absorber shield. And then uh, kind of drop down quickly, 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 quickly. <laughs> I need that resistance. So it was more just to... Whoa, look at how quickly my health dropped. Holy jeez. So my thinking there, if you guys are wondering why did I do that. Um, I had multiple players shooting me. My thinking is if I go into the air, you have the absorber shield. So that's why I did that. And then I figured once I, let's just try to get this guy, once I, um, once they run out of the ability, then I kind of drop down and I kill them that way. That was my thinking. <laughs> it didn't quite work out, uh, you know, in my favor there. Holy jeez, we're doing a lot of damage to this guy. Jeez. We're talking about a Ravana here. That's when you know these weapons are too powerful. When you're using regular robots to take out titans <laughs> with this, you know something is up. Ooh, I should drop in with that behemoth. So I have a behemoth with those weapons. I want to see how much damage that's going to do. We're going to drop in over here. Here we go, boys. I need to get onto this beacon first. So we're going to do that. And let's do that. Whoa, look at his health. Oh my gosh. Holy shoot. This guy too. Oh my gosh. Maybe that guy. <laughs> it's like, sit boy, sit. He's hiding behind the, the building back there. You know what's going to happen. This guy, he needs... That shield needs to drop. Oh. I can't get him. This guy needs to go into flight. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I need a shield. Yes, we got the shield. This guy. Oh my gosh, his health. He's like, oh, this is a bad idea. Yep, it definitely is a bad idea. <laughs> oh, oh, shoot. This guy has his, uh... I need my shield. Oh, jeez. The shield. I can't get him. Oh man, I'm gonna go down. That build is... That build's crazy strong. Okay, so we have the Minos next. Let's see if we can maybe get a little bit closer to their Titans. This guy is pretty, uh, pretty low on health here. Maybe we can pick him up. I'm just uh, waiting for my other ability here because it's almost uh, ready. We're going to try to take out uh, this Arthur. Let's do that. Oh man, I totally stole it. <laughs> he had been working on that guy for like a minute. Let's use my reflector shield. Uh-oh. 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 Gotta go, gotta go. He's, he's, uh, it's gonna run out. We gotta get him now. No, no, no. Ooh, no, yes. <laughs> Jeez, I don't even know how I survived that. That's crazy. Trying to get this uh, beacon here. And coming. Oh, jeez, I just steamrolled that dude. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to push... 
Oh man, that was uh, kind of exciting at the end there. Okay, so unfortunately we crashed there, so I wasn't able to show you guys the score at the end. But let me know what you guys think of this new robot Favna. And uh, also, if you haven't checked out my video, uh, you know, showcasing the Scaddy, the Snare, which is the light version, and the Hell, definitely check it out. I'll leave a link to that in the video description. Uh, or you could also go to the videos part of my channel and you can check it out uh, that way. But um, I think that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. And until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.